Manuscript Ending is about Bellingham, Washington, which is the city that we all met and we started playing in. Um, and life was really easy in Bellingham. It was, it's a college town, rent was cheap, I'm sure it's not now. Um, but you know, it was, it was just a very idyllic time for all of us. Personally, it was a time of a lot of kind of creative discovery and, and you know, kind of a time where I was learning how to write songs, trying to find my own voice. The scene that we were in in Bellingham was it was it was a big deal to about 30 people, you know, and it was one of those scenes that when you're in the middle of it, it feels like you're in the center of the universe, even though nobody outside of this town cares. It was really important for all of us to be a part of that insular group of people at that time to, to kind of gain the confidence to go out in the world and try to share music with people. Jack Kerouac and the Beats were very important to me in my kind of early formative years as a songwriter, and they still are, but certainly at that time I was reading a lot of them. And one thing I really admired about Kerouac was how he just lionized all of the people around him, and he kind of, he made these very small moments in time seem very grandiose and very important. And, you know, with a song like Movie Script Ending, I wanted to name check all these places to make sure that I remembered them, but I think also people who are living in Bellingham now, kids who are going to school there now, like a lot of them who are music fans know that we're from there. They know what these references are. They know the house we live in when we record the first record. And, you know, I kind of like being part of that.